A building is much more than just walls, doors, and windows. February is Kirkland History Month. We wanted to take a closer look at the historic Heritage Hall, located a few blocks north from Marina Park. It's hard to miss with its white pillars, Greek temple portico, and neoclassic style. Heritage Hall was originally built in 1922 in the Norkirk neighborhood and served as a church until 1960. It then became an office for an architectural firm until the land was sold and the building was set to be demolished. Wanting to preserve the history of the building, Kirkland residents sprang into action. One resident went above and beyond, spearheading the effort to save Heritage Hall. Bob Burke was a persuasive presence during city council meetings while also helping to raise $250,000 for the restoration of the building. Bob Burke, who was the president at that time and very much uh, uh, an advocate of getting a space for us, he was always at the city asking for a space. We would not have the building if it wasn't for Bob. Once it was decided to save the building, it needed a new home. After careful consideration, the area now known as Heritage Park was selected. The location was a former school site and was vacant at the time. In 1999, Heritage Hall made the half-mile journey using the wheels from an old 747 jumbo jet and quickly became an iconic fixture in Kirkland. Bob Burke passed away in May of 2013, but in 2011, he shared one of his memories of the building's move. The day that it was moved, I remember the first lurch off the old foundation. <laughs> what it looked like it might fall into the street. <laughs> but uh, the movers did a great job of, of uh, moving it down First Street and, and then up and on to the site. Uh, uh, that, but my heart was pounding when that, when that occurred. Today, the upper level of Heritage Hall can be rented out for events, and the lower level houses the Kirkland Heritage Society. If you are interested in learning more of our city's past, visit the Kirkland Heritage Society in person or on its website, kirklandheritage.org.